Evansville back at the Ford Center Tuesday looking to bounce back against the Missouri State Bears. We fast forward to the second half. After 10 ties through the first 25 minutes, David Howard trying to spark UE. First with a dunk, then with a pair of free throws, and a layup to give UE a 45-42 lead. Evansville would extend the lead to four with 13 minutes to play on a DJ Ballantyne three-pointer, but Missouri State would rally to force a 51-all tie midway through the half before UE would finally break away. A steal and a layup by Adam Wing, who had a season-high 17 points, started the run. Then after a pair of Mislav Berzoya free throws, Blake Simmons got a transition layup to push the lead to six. A Jalen Moore layup would give UE a 59-51 lead with seven minutes to play, and the Aces would not look back. Ballantyne finished with 20 to join Wing in double figures, and Evansville snapped a three-game losing streak with a 73-66 win over Missouri State. Here's what they had to say in postgame. This group has not been uh, very satisfied with, with the results, that, and they've, they've continued to work hard. They've continued to try to get better. Uh, I like the way the guys stepped up today. I thought Jalen and David both played really well on the inside. I mean, we, we had... We had pretty solid sound play from, from everybody. We, we need to make some shots, but uh, you know, turn it over three times uh, was outstanding. Coaches had a good game plan for us just to, just to be ultra aggressive. We had some things, different schemes set up on the offensive end. Um, but just you know the coaches all week, last two days, just telling us to be aggressive, be aggressive, be aggressive. Just kind of get that bad taste out of our mouth. So I just try to be aggressive, aggressive as I could. Uh, we're all you know, very glad to Get back in the win column. Uh, you know, it stinks to, to lose, especially how we've been losing the past three games. But, uh, you know, it's a good win. We just got to keep it moving. Uh, uh, this Saturday is going to be another big one. So, you know, I've liked this team from day one. I like this team now. We got, we've got a long way to go. We still got a lot of room for improvement. Uh, you know, we haven't had this team together since before Christmas. So we're hoping that Agidius can, can, can get well here real quick get our guys back and, and uh, continue to have a good work ethic and improve and let's see what happens.